We didn't rent a life-size Easter bunny to deliver this invite, but we still hope Heather agrees to hop on to the latest drama. Heather, it's time for Bravo. No, they didn't. Oh, I am ready. Okay, Salt Lake City, <laughs> what advice would you give Monica when it comes to her roller coaster relationship with her mom, Linda? Again, no matter what you bring up when it comes to like childhood trauma, your mom has a different idea of what happened, so you just gotta take it. You gotta give your parents grace, but you just gotta know they're never gonna admit. And my mom has never done anything wrong. She's watching tonight, and I love her, you know? Uh, do you understand? <laughs> Do you understand why Lisa is being so secretive about Jack's mission when hanging around Heather? I mean, I understand why she's being sensitive about it, but come on, like, just just say it. We're gonna find out. Yeah. I don't understand, like, I love Heather, and everybody thinks that I'm Heather Gay out in the world, so, hey, girl, hey. <laughs> uh, although seemingly annoyed with every little thing, why do you feel Mary decided to rejoin the gang this year, and what's been your favorite Mary moment? Um, she, re she decided to rejoin because she's raising money for a new rec room at the church, so I get it. Um, and uh, what was the second part? I don't know. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. New York City. Uh, do you think it was fair of Cy to get so upset with Brynn over spilling the Mr. Connecticut tea with the group? Yes, absolutely, because I'm going to tell you this right now. When you sit at a table and you gossip and you spill the tea, you know what people don't do? Then tell people that you're the one who started the rumor. So, yes, she should have been upset. Wait, that's my life right now. Yeah. Did you have a problem with Jess all constantly comparing her life story to the others? It was so dramatic. Like, not everybody's a victim. Just be honest. You were raised with a little bit of money. Overall, which of these ladies was your MVP this season? Brynn. Brynn took an Adderall every day before she got up. <laughs> she gave me energy. In fact, I did my hair tonight to look like her, hey. Um, so I, I live for her. Um, uh, Beverly Hills, oh, what did you think of the trailer? Who are you most excited to see this season? <sighs> I'm just sweating. Um, Cam uh, Camille's yeah. coming back, right? Um, Camille's on a bit. A bit. Okay, well, I'm excited to see Camille make her little, you know, sprinkle little appearances. I, I live for her. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.